Hey guys, welcome to the channel. It's your guy Dwayne from DMS Sense. Hey guys, I just want to bring you another video. Uh, I watched a couple videos yesterday and my good homie, Jeremy from the House of Colossus, he tagged me and this was going around is Black Bottle Bangers. And who I'm going to tag in the upcoming video is my guy that I watch a lot too. Uh, Trey Sense, you up. I'm tagging you, buddy. So I want to see your black bottles whenever you get a chance to see this video. And if you guys, if you follow him, let him know that he's been tagged to show his black bottles off. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to get into my black bottle bangers and see how you guys feel them. Let's rate them, guys. You know, in no particular order, I'm just going to name off some and uh, go through what I like about them and, and are they a black bottle banger. So let's get it started, guys. My first one going to be a bottle that I just got. Took me a long time to get it. I don't know why I slept on it as long as I did. But it's this Lavender Musky Beast right here, guys. And it comes from the house of Latafa. Food of glory. Guys, when I say this is a banger, probably a banger, probably a banger. Yes, guys, this right here, I just got it, like I said, in... I don't know, it took me so long, because as soon as I wore it yesterday, compliments right out the, right out the uh, jump, guys. This is a lavender monster, guys. It's a patchouli monster. And it's one of my black bottle bangers. Again, from the House of Latafa, food for glory. Guys, we're going to keep it rolling, guys. This one is a lightly used fragrance that I wear. And uh, haven't got any buzz about it. Wore it a few times. Didn't really, no compliments from it, but that's okay. It is from the house of Kenneth Cole, and it's called Black Bold. What a beautiful bottle. Guys, this is more of a green scent, but it's a green fall scent, so it opens up very fresh. So you can wear this one, I would say fall and spring, guys. And if you want to feel funky and, and froggy, you can wear this in the summer. Just tone down your sprays, guys, because it... It's like I said, it's fresh. It's not as overpowering that you would think it would be being in a black bottle. So, guys, again, Ken of Cole, Black Bold. Guys, my next one. Everybody should have this one. This one is not even gonna get talked about as much because we have been talking about this one for years. This is probably the clone of clones. And uh, I'm just gonna bring it up, guys. I don't even have to say the name of this one. It's Everybody know what this is. And every guy that has black bottles is gonna have this black bottle banger, guys. No other than Club Du Nui, Intense Smell. Guys, once you get past that opening of that lemony pledge smell, which I don't mind it, this scent right here has been goaded, guys. So get your hands on this. I love it. I wear it all the time. I don't wear it. I don't care any particular season. I'm gonna wear this one, guys. Again, the clone of clones. <laughs> My next one is, it's a fragrance that I got a while ago. I wear it time to time, but it's a quiet stunner. And it goes by the name of Bad Boy from the house of Carolina Herrera. Black Bottle Banger, guys. Amber Monster, Date Night Monster. Women love this, trust me, guys. You put this on your neck, your girl give you a hug, thank me later. We're gonna go to the next one, guys. This is a challenging one, guys. A lot of people like to stay away from this, but I'm going to tell you, this right here, Moschino's Toy Boy, go get it, guys. I know the bottle is a turn off. I know the bottle throws a lot of people off, but this Rose Monster, guys, is some of the sweetest, long-lasting uh, fragrance that you can have. You're going to at least get eight hours of longevity. You're going to get at least three hours of projection arm lift, guys. And if you can get past the bottle, and I, I know it's hard for some guys because we didn't have the base about this, get it. You won't be going wrong with this one, guys. Machino's Toy Boy. <laughs> Grow ahead and grab it. Don't mind the bottle. And my last but not least fragrance has quickly become one of my staples. It has become one of my go-tos, and it's been known for me as that, that vanilla monster, guys. And it's no other than... Mercedes Benz Club Black. Theatrics, guys. I love the theatrics. This is a fingerprint magnet on this bottle, so guys, don't, don't hit me too hard over the head with the fingerprints. But this is a vanilla monster. 
I'm not gonna speak on it so much because I didn't talked about it at nausea in, in video after video, but this right here is the Vanilla Monster, and this is probably gonna be my signature scent. Nah, it is my signature scent, what I'm talking about, because I wear this frequently, guys. So, being said, that is, those are my black bottle bangers, and I wanna thank Jeremy from the House of Colossus. Trey Sense, you're up, brother. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Thank you, peace.